This is to Oliver Anthony Music. It's an open message, as it were. This is an instant grace segment here on Grace Archie with, and I'm Jim Babka. You know, Chris, my friends are forwarding your video to me. In fact, the first video you did, uh, it's a pleasure to meet you, part two. Uh, I had three friends within 12, 15 hours that sent this to me and said we should, they felt you and I should talk. And I debated whether or not I should send anything to you or say anything at all until this morning. When I saw a clip of you on Joe Rogan. Now, I didn't end up in the hospital, but the other parts you describe, that breakdown that ends up becoming a bit of a road to Damascus experience for you, well, that happened to me at age 29. I already had three kids at that point, and it set me on a journey where today I'm talking to you. I know you're busy, and I'm not going to be fake. I'm not a, uh, I'm, I like some 90s country music, uh, Garth Brooks, Brooks and Dunn. I'm not a big country music fan. I, I'm more of a hair metal guy. That's not what we have in common. I'm not even asking you to be on my show. Now, this podcast here is newish, and I have more work than a full-time job, so we haven't yet built the audience that we intend to build here yet. That's coming, but I bet you can relate to the long work hours. This show is small because we have some serious discussions here about the dangers of statism, the theft of inflation, the inability of neighbors, and even family members to talk, and the failure to solve our problems together, voluntarily, instead of turning to politicians who seek to divide us into what I call a conflict machine. Now, you're welcome to come on the show, but that's not what I'm asking. I'd just like to talk. I'd, I'd come meet you. And scrolling through the episodes of this show, or even searching Jim Babka on Google, would allow you to inspect my heart. Because if we sat down, I'd want to have a heart-to-heart -heart about theology, faith, human respect, grace, the massive theft of inflation, war, and more. A message that goes way beyond politics. Indeed, regarding inflation, hardly anyone understands how bad they're being robbed, how much the working man is being hurt. And you know, Jesus got angry one time. It was the temple bankers of his time who were robbing the poor, and today it's central bankers. Anyway, what I'm offering or requesting is a very interesting conversation about profound subjects. Indeed, Grace Archie is about that state of relationship modeled by Jesus Christ that goes beyond tolerance, which is good, or forgiveness, which is even better than tolerance. But grace is that state where we carry the cross and go the extra mile even better we, to, to places that we find, or with people we even find, incomprehensible. Now, not only does tolerance follow, but so does the golden rule. We learn to stop being busybodies. We learn that we can escape the conflict machine, which is a much better name uh, than mere politics. And we can stop coercing others to live by our values or standards. We start practicing human respect. Now, I, as I indicated, have about a half dozen different jobs plus this podcast. Nevertheless, I'd like to get in the, I'd get in the car to come talk to you if, because I admire your decision to repudiate partisan affection and big contracts that might interfere with your ability to speak your true message. I see a potentially pure heart. Now, I say potentially because how do I know who you really are? And obviously, how do you know who I really am? We've only seen each other on YouTube. If you're interested in talking, please send me an email using comments at zeroaggressionproject.org. That's the comments address located in the footer of zeroaggressionproject.org who sponsor this show. And if not, Godspeed to you, Chris.